Hi everyone! For this you're gonna need black paper, a pencil and a knife or scissors. Start by simply drawing an eye and then either use a knife or some scissors to cut the image out. It's very easy. I use two pieces of paper on top of each other so that I'll have two eyes at once. Now do the exact same thing to create a mouth. If necessary, trim the edges to create the exact shape you want it to be. Of course you're gonna need a white fridge because ghosts are white and then just look for the right placement and use some scotch tape to simply stick it on your fridge. It's really as easy as that. And there you have it, the cutest fridge ghost ever. It looks so cute. So for this you're gonna need either white or very light stockings, a lot of spiders and some balls. I use big big onions because the effect is exactly the same. So then you're gonna put a onion into a stocking and hang them on some kind of rod or anywhere where you can hang them and they already look really disgusting. Um, I use these glow-in-the-dark spiders, they have a little hook on them, so it's really easy to attach them to the stockings. If it's not that easy, just use some glue or make a hole in the stocking and stick the spiders in and there you have your disgusting spider egg sex. So for this you need a piece of white paper, scissors and a pencil. Use the pencil to trace around your hand on the white piece of paper. Then cut out the hand. Make folds in the paper fingers at your knuckle creases. Now fold the paper fingers in half lengthwise and pinch at the crease folds at the same time to pucker the paper to form the joints. Then cut between the fingers at the palm section and repeat all steps. And that's it, your skeleton hand is finished. You're gonna need a thin trash bag, scissors and some tape. Start off by cutting open all the edges so you'll end up with two rectangular um, pieces of trash bag. Then fold it to make it a square. Trim away the excess trash bag. Fold it again. Fold it again and once more to make a cone-shaped figure. Use tape to close the open side so that your uh, cone shape won't move. Now simply use the scissors to make some cuts into the trash bag because that's going to be your spider web. Once you've cut it all up, fold it open again and 
and separate the two trash bags from each other. Trim some edges if necessary and you're completely done. You'll have amazing, perfect, cute spider webs. This is super easy. All you need is some soap and a lot of bugs. Open the bottles, make sure that they're see-through. Uh, they can be colored but see-through or else of course you won't see the bugs. And uh, well simply open the bottles and put the bugs in. That's it. This will definitely gross your guests out. Yuck. So I hope you liked my video, please let me know which one you like best in the comments below. Bye bye!